Gmail.com, though. It's highlights, uh, no, no money. So, uh, enjoy. Number 10 on a 13-game schedule, the rookie Paul George. Oh, John! Misses the three and opts for the higher percentage shot with the one-handed flush. Number nine, so divine. DJ Augustine. Crazy good. First to Hezzy on, on Jameer Nelson. And then he clowns on Dwight with the sick reverse. Number eight is always great. Don't you dare hate. Rudy Fernandez with the miss. Nicholas Batum goes kaboom. He's got his back. Blazers get a big win. Number seven. You know, everybody can't be a leader, right? Will Bynum does not mind being a follower, especially with results like that. Get it? All right. Number six, Nets Sixers, Philly on the run. How about a Iggy Too Young connection? Andre Iguodala dropping the dime to that. Halfway through, number five. Timberwolves uh, on the run, and Dwayne Wade is having none of that. Just beats Wayne Ellington's stuff here, and then he looks at him. See, if I was Wayne, my feelings would be hurt. I'm just going to tell the truth. Number four, Pacers and Bucks. Luke with Javai Mute gets yanked on by Roy Hipper with a far attack. Like the police. Number three, Cavs and Wizards. Oh, oh, Jordan Crawford, the rookie, cloud. First, he breaks off the uh, the crazy spin, and then he goes between the legs, the trailing Andre Blotch. Tasty. Number two, though, is just it is unbelievable. Two seconds left in the half, and this happens. Who does Marcus Gasol think he is? A Mecca Hoka for somebody? Beats the buzzer falling out of bounds. But your top play from Friday belongs to LeBron James. Gets fouled here and uh, gets the bucket to go. Now the rest would call the under three timeout. He would come back, go to the free throw line. He would miss. Everybody thought he had two free throws, including Chris Bosh, who tried to hand the ball to the ref. Kudos to LeBron, he's the only guy that knows what's going on. That's why he's the king, so he steals it from his own teammate and throws it down. Heat win, that's your top six.